I hit return the main menu without meaning to. All right. Oh, let's give it one or two more runs because I feel like I am wearing down on my energy. And I'm also going to have an early morning tomorrow anyway for work and everything like that. So just got to take that on the chin and just say, well, actually got to get some sleep before work tomorrow. Right? Right. But make for the switch to make them look like the switch, I guess. To be fair, that like, uh, the funny thing about it was, yeah, Engage was supposed to come out before Three Houses in the Fire Emblem timeline. Because it was made to celebrate the 25th anniversary of, what's his face, uh, Fire Emblem exactly so. So, those towers was exactly meant to represent the Joy-Cons and everything like that. And just, you know, to be a very much a resounding love letter to the series and everything like that or so. Unfortunately, COVID pushed it back by a huge margin. The houses came around in the pipeline and then Engage came out. You know, a good little while past the initial due date of, you know, when it's uh, when it was expected to actually be around or so. So that's just really unfortunate for how Engage just kind of, you know, sputtered out a little bit more. But also when it comes to, if you want to compare it to the designs of, uh, if you want to compare it to the designs of, not, I don't know what I'm to say here. To designs of three houses on the other hand or so they also sorry, the developers have very much so candidly gone on record and saying they want to make um engage be as completely opposite from three houses as possible both for the end of uh, sorry, both on the end of gameplay but also story which is why we got what is essentially a saturday morning cartoon power rangers Story, as opposed to the very big intrigue for politics and everything like that, or so that is three houses, and that's not necessarily a diss at all on any point when it comes to either story or so. It's just one very much so a very interesting sticking point that a lot of people I feel lose, not say lose and forget when we are talking about these games, but also on the extent, uh, but also on the extent of when it comes to. And being able to say, yeah, one like, people might prefer one game, people might prefer the other, but they were made both in their own vacuums, and also in the developers' understanding minds of, hey, we are not trying to make the same game as Three Houses, despite how well it was received. We are making our own game, and we made it. We made it pretty well, all things considered, is what I definitely say. You know, buy bowl or so, so then I still have my multiplier from Joker Stencil. Since I have so much money anyway, this is just wonderful to see. I can just two pair the night away. Because, yeah, all the extra chips just means my... I just need to get, like, a multiplier one way or another. Be it from some moat cards or anything more of that sort. And then we are absolutely chilling on this entire run. Uh, straight's my other hand that I have to be better. That's something I'm really struggling for these early antes. It's just gonna see how it goes otherwise. I love you not to sign so I pick up the game eventually. People laughed at Haya Papaya and look at where she is now, people. Haya Papaya is paying off in strides and the Unata agenda continues to thrive, people. I'm telling you. People may have laughed at her in the beginning, but who's laughing now? You not just sweep absolutely took the game by storm. Very much so, with just how great her personality is. Granted, she is one of the deeper characters in Engage. But right, her design is absolute pee, too. <laughs> Alright. Emperor me. Yeah, I very much so want Tarot Merchant because I need to be buying as many, as many, 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 many Tarot cards as I potentially can here. So I want to be able to have my cards be much better since my Jokers are going to be naturally weaker if I'm going to be running Joker Stencil for this run. <sighs> that and with Bull also existing in my lineup. And, you know, being a permanent spot thanks to the Eternal uh, Tad, I need to be just holding on to as much Econ as possible. 
Now, Hiker is gone. It's still gonna be four butts for me, though, and he paid off pretty well. Hmm. Certificate could be good, but let's just go ahead and see if we can add a few enhanced cards one way or another. Totally fine by me. And yeah, let's just run with let's just run with these two jokers and really see how things go. That's halfway there. Oh how is it really ain't helping me that much, but yeah. Probably like one multiplier or one side stencil could definitely be the breaking point for me, all things considered here. That I want this jack to store too though. And then we are very much there still chilling. Yeah, I have so many chips, but unless I actually have a way for times four or what's times three gonna go off, I need help. So maybe if I can get Well, if I can just get anything to help out with that. Mo cards absolutely so is the high priority, so yes please, very much. I took a risk, it was not worth it in that case. Right, the bus could potentially get me up there. Since I'm, uh, since I'm blue dead, I think that would actually be the, without a doubt, the biggest thing. I think I need right the bus to scale, so as much as 40 bucks would be great, I'd rather just play... Yeah, play my high card. Let things scale. Remember, it's storing cards, so I, if I have anything else going... When it comes to having my, uh, when it comes to having my, ways go out, that's gonna be fine. I can't play base cards, so that so that choker I actually did add is absolutely useless, sadly now, and that the choker, the jet that I add is absolutely useless. But you've seen here, the fact that I'm already going much higher on my mold than just twelve to begin with is monumental for me. And then now, any yeah, any high cards. Would be great potentially. And the pairs would be great potentially here. They have a time totally fine too, since I'm just gonna be bricking a little bit more. And also buy crystal ball just to have in case. That's right, my chips are really a problem anyway. Remember, it's storing, storing face cards. So I can just use, especially since I have limited discards, I can just use any of my regular cards otherwise, to get rid of face cards at any and all times. Have read the bus go off. That is 1000% fine by me. Uh, play these out. Maybe I can play towards a flush. I can get a flush, but let's see if I can't cheese out for one more hand. Nah, nah. A little bit too much, but it's all fine on that end. Ceremonial Dodger Suts, not useful to me. Let's say Emoid would be great. That's not gonna happen. I guess I'll just sigil. I don't want a negative effect necessarily on my head here, so I'll just chill. Yeah, give me that Ace of Hearts, and let's see what we can or cannot get with this here. So, first and foremost, I have the pair. I'm gonna play it out. At least, right, the bus is getting there. But I need to get a lot more Muah than just that. Let's so say I can point towards the flush, and that'll be, of course, four molt plus no everything more onwards. So that can be huge. No, not much. I'll be honest with you, Chief. Can't point the two jats together, otherwise Brit break uh, um ride the bus. But I don't know if this is actually enough here, because ride the bus is going. Okay, that actually bails me out completely. Right, the rest of scaling is still absolutely slow. And, you know, it's not that I'm really getting too much more unless I get a polychrome. Even just like a foil in one of these cards. Not the best, but I'll just sell you for the two bots. I will go ahead and buy Tarot Tycoon. Because that needs to be done for the future. And I already went out of the shop. 25k is doable. I'm not doing the most confident about it, but it is doable. I can just easily get a flush and then have something go off on that end. Or, you know, just get more pairs and just keep riding. If I could only upgrade them, though. That's like my only low end card that has not been upgraded yet. Once again, at the very least, uh, let's face it. Tarot Merchant is paying. Not Tarot Merchant, I read the bus is getting its scaling going. Oh, 
Oh, that's a little too much. Not what I want. I will take the force, though, potentially. And let's just see what we potentially get. I will take that 10. That is wonderful to see. Erosion is polychrome, though. That is decent, I am not going to lie, but I need to remove cards. So, of course, I'd love to remove my face cards. I don't know how much mileage I can actually get on that end, then. That is pretty decent, I am not going to lie. But I need a lot more than decent if I want to make a run here. Well, that is a lot more than decent to get a full house, I am not going to lie. That's helped me a good bit. For the pair, get rid of a chain that waits out of the hand. Uh, can't pull those out yet, but with the pair, get rid of the chain again. I still have one more hand. This should be enough, more than anything. Yeah, this is a bit of a struggle, and the reason is, of course, not popping off until I can actually buy a tarot to remove it. High card getting better. It's probably better than pair. Yeah, it is better than pair after that, unfortunately. I will take the stone card. That's useful, very much so. Alright, we play it like this, that way I can get rid of all those face cards, basically. Without any worry in the world. Let's change y'all over. Uh... I got rid of Mold 7. I am not happy about that at all, Bob. Not happy. I am scared that those are face cards, potentially, and that does not make me the happiest either. I'm just gonna have to discard down like this. Let's just play things out. Hope for the best, question mark. I gotta hope. Okay, I know that these are gonna be aces in this case, just because they drew to the left of my turn ace. That's fine. That one finally broke the one of my gold seal, and that is so sad. But hopefully, I can remove some things sooner or later. I'm not gonna get to remove things. I will buy these, though. I charge it's better. I charge it's better. Ooh! And I have uncommons. Absolutely, that is a huge pivot. I am not going to lie, Chief. That's an absolutely huge pivot to have. They can turn you into a stone card and never have to worry about you again. And honestly, I can just go high card gaming. Oh, baby girl, are we in this game? Potentially. High card is better than two pair, which is absolutely atrocious that it even is. But frankly, I can just keep playing so much just because of Ride the Bus. Which is totally fine by me. Wee! Wee! Exactly so. Yes! Ride the Bus gets the, gets the scale. And honestly, getting that pivot is great. Now I just need Erosion to just start removing whatever face cards if I potentially can. If I can. Otherwise, these Swastical Pats are just going to keep paying their way forwards. Honestly. Yeah, high card build gaming, boys. This is such an awkward way to really just play the game, but it's, you know, it's what's going on. They don't take strength, that way it's another way for me to start getting rid of these face cards potentially. Yeah, I can have something like this. Take you like this. Uh, Flush is still better than high card by a decent amount, so I can play that out without any remorse. I should have played the chain out because there's no reason for me not to. To just get rid of it out of my hand. But with all my hands here, I still want my Ride the Bus to scale. So, let's take it easy, Cruzy. Just play the bottom hands, and then we'll just see how many more hands we can sneak. Ah, uh, you're not sneaking any hands, actually. Never mind. My bad. Let's 
seed money might be the play here, unironically, to have steel into the future, but I'm just re-rolling through seed money can get. All right, yeah, find seed money, because bowl, I want those chips preserved, and also, well, if I'm going to be able to f find a way to bypass, that oh, it's his face, to bypass, um, bypass my breaking point of econ, and actually get a chance to... Wow, I'm really not gonna get A off here, am I? To buy some deaths potentially for erosion? Then I need to just get things going more. Or my overall econ state. Yeah, I can't play any other hand types, which is hilarious. Just considering the fact that uh high card is the best and then followed by sorry, flush is the best followed by high card what my card standards are at the moment. But it's otherwise that, and then I can just play towards, yeah, the hard flushes. But I'm not struggling to necessarily make ends meet by any means. It's just all about having to ride the bus, just keep ticking, ticking, ticking. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. That's the 41. Finally, I can... I can absolutely just start destroying some cards and erosions. Finally, we're gonna get to pop off slightly. Ooh, I think I don't like that special patch. Darn it. Ah, oh, darn it, dude. I was, I was really hoping to get MO8, and I did not, because I would have had erosion pop off. Oh, wait, because I added cards. Erosion shouldn't do jack shit. Oh, I am so stupid, too, because I've added so much. That even when I remove those queens, erosion is still doing nothing. I mean, I guess it's a times three mold basically thanks to baseball card. But gosh darn it, dude! I just also realized how absolutely atrociously useless I have made that out to be by no fault of anybody's own but mine. Oops! Yeah, uh, it's gonna take two deaths to even have erosion start ticking up for me. But it's not right once again. At the very least. I am not suffering for hands or anything of that sort when it comes to actually hitting these antis yet is the keyword. That's of course always going to be the sticking point yet. And I definitely could have played three more hands to have ride the bus keep going more, but uh, whatever. Double my money. I doubled my money and then I immediately tipped down on it all, so who's really the fool now but me? Death this. Uh, Hierophant this. I will play five cards out and make a five card flush. With all enhanced cards, you love to see it. Uh, decent gains. Not the best without a doubt, could have been better. That'll be a pair of scoring three, so I can play the jack without any fear. Three of kind actually does hurt here, considering how I want high card to go off instead. Hoping I'd get a money tick on that, but it's no big deal otherwise. I'll just keep pulling things out. And we're, we're going to make anti without, a, without any problems. Comes down to how many more hands am I going to get to dump it to ride the bus? The answer, not three more. Ah, uh, mistakes again. I mean, it's not the biggest deal ever. Wah! Ah, oh, that's for Well, it still is something. I will, I will take it. Because the fact is, that was a... What's his face? That was a real fortune that actually did hit. So, can I complain? Not really. Oh, erosion can proc now. Let's freaking go, dude! How many face cards even left? Uh, a few, actually. So, play these out. I'll save the hangman for when I can destroy with my erosion. I, I bought the crystal orb earlier, too. Or crystal, crystal orb. Crystal ball earlier, too. So then... Will be fine for me to just go ahead and say, Yeah, get them out. And Erosion finally is offering some molt. Oh, I am the happiest camper in all of human history. You don't know how happy I am right now, dude, for Erosion to be doing something. Oh, baby girl, does it feel good? Yeah, the fact that I was able to, you know, 
have a pretty decent early game, all things considered, and to pivot off of Stencil pretty flawlessly without even any recompense. Baseball card coming in like and just at the perfect timing is great. Uh, yeah. Make Flush better, because that's my only other better card. And then let's see what we can't get for my value here. I will make this king a 8. Because I want that steel benefit to go off. You'll love to see it, you'll love to see it. And yeah, just high cards will go off. I can't believe that also this is just an unironic high card build that is absolutely paying a million dividends on itself. Just being able to play as many cards, you know, as as I as, as many hands as I can, without even thinking about it, just for ride the bus to proc. Because I okay, that's gonna be three hands once again. That's going out to it, but that still is two chips otherwise for all those hands. So it's it's benefiting me one way or the other at the very least. Honestly, I don't buy anything. Amber eight going to go off, and I don't care. Like really get shuffled around here. I'll be honest with you, Chief. High card goes off, ace goes off. Okay, I I should have slowed things down so I could actually take track of which was which out of my things here. And I'll be honest, I don't know which cards were actually... I really should be shadowing. Your bowl. Your baseball card. I don't know if order really honestly matters here for my current state of things. Okay, I am actually struggling to recognize which cards are which. But it's fine, it's fine. Okay, yeah, yeah, you are right, the bus. And then I have another flush about to come in. Yeah, with three hands left, this run is basically done and dusted. We are totally fine. You love to see it. Great work, Cruzy. Absolutely, that is one of, like... Yeah, once again, one of the smoothest pivots that I've ever had, and not out of problem with at all. Nice stuff. Okay, well, Erosion was there, but honestly, it wasn't too much there, so pretty happy with that. I will go ahead and call things there, but first and foremost, uh, what Joker did I get? On it. There you go. All right, but yeah, nice stuff, Cruzy. Really nice, because that is another death that I have finished through with Valtro now on Gold State, so that's... And so, yeah, that is one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, five deaths out of the out of the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, a third of the Boucho deaths overall completely done with all of the state challenges. Not bad, Crazy, not bad. Alrighty, I'll, we're gonna go ahead and call it there tonight. I'm pretty happy about that run. Wherever you are, wherever you may be, whether you're on Twitch or YouTube or more, it's been your wonderful and made, your cruise ship servant, our cruise proxy, ever and always at your service. Uh, I know I have a full day tomorrow when it comes to for, what's his face, for work. So I'm probably not gonna be streaming tomorrow because I have to also get up early in the morning on Monday to go to the dealership and hopefully figure out what's going on with my car problems. But I do have Monday off, so I should be back then on there. And then we'll just see what I want to stream. Because I'll actually have a schedule put out then, hopefully. But at least from my side of the world, have yourselves a wonderful night, everybody. And thank you once again for all coming along.